I'm sorry, I forgot your name. My name's Tim. 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 From Jole Mole. From Haile Miley. I had some Jole Mole once when we met. It's delicious. In Spain. Some chips and Jole Mole. Yeah. Now, the film was a big success. Mm. Would it be okay to say that it rescued your career? Well, it would be okay, but it's not quite true. I mean, it, it is Maybe very... financially. Hmm? Maybe financially. Yeah, but who cares about that? Exactly. I mean, you know. No, we point. just do this for the fun of it. Yeah. No, actually, actually, it's great to, to be uh, you know, back on the big screen and be introduced to a whole new generation of folks. But, you know, we were working all those years doing yeah. other stuff. Yeah. It's just uh, suddenly you do a movie, you're on the big screen, you're huge, literally, and, and it makes a big difference. Well, um, for you, Kermit, it probably it hasn't changed your life significantly. You're already yeah. a kind of globally recognizable icon. I was just wondering maybe if some of the other cast had been perhaps rescued from obscurity. Uh, well, uh, you well, might want to talk to my friend about that. Referring a bit. to me? Not necessarily you, but you know, but just possibly. wondering how it might have changed your life, perhaps not being. Well, I, I don't think so because I'm I'm in one scene. Yeah. In the movie, okay. So I think I'm. You know, I I was incredible before, and I'm incredible now, and I will be incredible forever. So do you think being only in one scene has changed your life? Well, let me tell you something. No, I don't think so. No? Okay. But let me tell you something. I, may, I am incredible in this scene, Tim. Holy moly, I'm good in this scene. Okay. Do you know Anthony Quinn won an Oscar for being in uh, Last for Life for 10 minutes? Okay. True? It's true. Wow. So, you know, just because it's, it's all about the, the talent. Hmm. Okay. I mean, I imagine you've all kind of been in demand since you've come back into the limelight. I was wondering kind of what work you've been offered and, and in particular what work you might have turned down. Hmm. Yeah, well, um, Mission Impossible. Really? Yeah, they asked me if the I next wanted one? to take on the no, no, the last one I was supposed to do, but Are, then the Muppet movie thing came up, so I took that instead. What would you have you done in Mission Impossible? Yeah, what would you have the done? Cruise, the cruise, the Tom Cruise role. Hmm. We're about the same height. Well, that much is true. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, would you consider doing reality TV? We've got a show here called Celebrity Big Brother that might hmm. be appropriate. We, we are. We are the ultimate reality yeah. ourselves. That, that's what the Muppets are all about. Hmm. It, you know, we, we are right here, right now, reality. And, and what we're doing at the moment, you and I and Pepe, is reality. Sure. And we're being filmed. And we're that's being a filmed. reality. And, 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 we're, and I'm not being particularly entertaining, but we're here nonetheless. <laughs> and that's a reality. You know, that's reality TV. Mm -hmm. So there exactly. you go. Mm -hmm. You've got it. Yeah. We also have another one where you just get to sit in the jungle and eat bugs. Oh, that's be... perfect. Wow, I want to be on that good show. For you. Yeah, you would like this. What is that show? That's I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here. I'm a Celebrity, Get Me In There. <laughs> I want to do that show. Can Somebody do write that down. Okay. Wow. Um, sustaining a, a romantic relationship in show business is very hard. Most of them end in divorce. And I was just wondering how you and Piggy have, have managed to stay together. Well, it's, it's, it's just a, a compliance on my part. It, uh, it, it tends to work. I recommend it to all men. Just, just don't even fight it. And Pepe, are you seeing anyone? All of the time. Yeah, several people at this time. Yeah, one is the, is the problem there. <clears throat> <laughs> yeah. Com what was the word you use? Compli com compliance. Compliance, like what? Yeah. Like a stove? Uh, a that's it's an appliance. Appliance. Well, in your case, it's not even a stove. Never mind. I also presume you might, because of your movie stardom, you were able to perhaps date people who previously would have been out of your league. Uh, well, do you know well, what league are you in? Uh, I'm bowling league. Yeah. Sunday nights, I'm a bowling league. Yeah. Uh, but uh, no, do you know all the women? They love me. It doesn't matter. I don't have to be in the movies for the women to love me, okay? You know, I, I have to say that, that Pepe's not just bragging. That's true. We've it's been all over London. Everywhere we go, the, the women just swoon. Yeah, come in my cab. Yep, yep. Come on, come in the store with come me. Come to my flat. Come to my flat. Come to my hotel. I'm what are you sure doing later? Are, I'm not sure these are good things, I think. Well, yeah, you can get in trouble, but, yeah. you know. Especially not get in my cab. That's... I'm having a great time. I hope. Um, uh, is there any news on the sequel? Well, yes. there's news that we're doing one. Yes, okay. Any, any kind of title or plot ideas floating no, around? No, not yet. Mm -hmm. not, oh, oh, do you have a... Yes, a lot. What do you know? Every, yeah. It's very, very exciting stuff. Yeah? I'm working on the treatment right now. You, you're writing the movie? Yes. It's a comedy, horror, thriller, drama. 
Wow. Kind of like Towering Inferno meets Poseidon Adventure, Jerry Maguire. You kind of covered it all. And there's a lot of celebrities going to be in it, like Howie Mandel and uh, uh, Ray Romano. Howie Mandel? Yes. This is, is the, this is the first you're hearing about it, Kermit. I think maybe Howie Mandel is playing me. No, no, no. Howie and Ray Romano play twins in this movie. Twins? Yeah, it's about yeah. twins yeah. who meet the Muppets and they try to save the theater. It's a brand new concept. It's a whole new idea for the Muppets. Keep working on it. It's going to be great. Is 80s Robot getting his own spin-off show? Well, he sort of is his own spin-off show. Yeah, yeah. No, I don't know what he's doing. I don't know where he is. Can I don't even it? know if he's charged. He's probably just sitting oh. there dormant in the corner. <gasps> Did you not charge him? I didn't plug him in. Oh, no. Well, it's the only way to get him to shut up. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah, you're welcome. Thank, Thank you, you. Tim. Very Holy nice Mole. to talk to you. Yeah. Can I just can I just mention that your shirt says the up hole? The up hole. That's a very interesting shirt. Holy moly. There's yeah. a big show over here. I don't know Is if it you got the up hole? Yeah. No. The up hole. Kind of an urban show. <laughs>